When it comes to security, one of the biggest targets in a home are the windows. Nearly a third of all break-ins occur through them, even when locked, so it's important that you ensure they're solid and secure. Install sash window screw locks. There's a good chance your sash windows already have these installed, but if not, they're an invaluable way to protect your property from forced entry. They're simple to install and very strong. All you need to do is to drill through both frames and install hardened metal barrels that keep them locked together. This method secures the sash windows and allows you to lock and unlock them with a key from inside. The added benefit is that these locks aren't visible from the outside and are impossible to pick. Just make sure you keep them locked. Make sure your sash windows are in good condition. The beauty of traditional timber framed sash windows is one of their biggest selling points, and it's hard to match their charm with modern up equivalents. The downside to timber windows is that they need to be regularly maintained to avoid rot, warping, and weather damage. Failing to keep windows painted and protected can leave them difficult to operate and vulnerable to attack. Old, brittle panes of window glass might just be the weak link in your home security setup. It's possible to upgrade the glass itself to modern, high-performance safety glass without changing the look of your traditional timber sash windows. Safety glass can be heat-treated, tempered or laminated in order to make it harder to break into, leaving you and your home safe and secure. What are sash window restrictors? You can fix a restrictor device into the frame in order to stop them from moving past a certain point. Available in a barrel shape like traditional stops, you can also order versions that use a spring-loaded tongue device that can be locked open or closed with a key. Are window restrictors safe? If they're installed correctly, they're incredibly safe. The industry standard opening size for sash windows in the UK is 100mm because it's too small for an infant to climb out of or for a burglar to climb in, 